son. Kanda's son able to cope with a brother's death created an imaginary world where he exists. Ooh. Ferb was disabled and can hardly talk or do much. Furbo? Doofus Schmerz is a psychiatrist. Candice sees him as a villain in her world. Her mum doesn't see the amazing adventures because of her brother because it's all in her. <gasps> Their mum never saw, you know. Alright, what's really good? What really is it? Who's this you on the mic off spinning? Yeah, shout out to T Dot, yeah. Today, man's reacting to TikToks that will ruin your childhood forever. I like to see you motherfucking try, bitch. I like to see you motherfucking try. Which is why, obviously, we're filming the, in the portrayal, landscaping, protraction, notation. We were filming this side up, yeah. Obviously, TikTok, this TikTok is this way up as well. You see me? So, boom. Before we get on, bruv, you know, you know the thing, fam. Like, share, subscribe, all of that YouTube stuff. Yeah, don't know, don't know. Yeah, but boom. Let that man not even waste no time on this. You get me? Let's let's get straight into it. Innit? Yeah, my childhood will not be ruined, fam. You cannot fuck with me, nigga. Let's go, bitch. Let's go, champ. Uh, TV show Hidden Meanings Part 1 Squidward though is uh, Spongebob's guardian Alright, uh, cool, 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 cool Promising his parents to protect him from ADHD <laughs> Yeah, Spongebob's pretty fucked up, he's definitely got ADHD Living and staying close to him, who's his neighbour <laughs> While also suffering from depression Squidward though, son Skin, some bullshit man <clears throat> the Rugrats were all actually. Ooh, shit! I heard, I heard. I've seen this one slightly, you know. All part of Angelica's imagination. Kono Angelica. Chucky died with his mom. Ooh, relax, son. They don't have their babies, bruv. Tommy. Yamete, Tommy. Fuck off, blood. Not dickhead, fam. Tom loved with everything he had. Tomu san. Oh, was I crying the blood? Oh, I swear that was a Oh, was I, I, I fought my nigga due for the grind off and wait, let me pull it back. Where was it? Where was it? Uh, I thought I was a grind, I thought my nigga was about to go and roll up and Jeez. But lost the love of his life to a richer guy. Ooh, what you wait? Bill for sale, one arm, one leg. It Tom signed his life away for her. Fell into depression and wanted to end it. Mm. Tom Jerry also lost the love of his life. Yeah, yo, this shit was pretty wild, bro. They sat together way yo, big man team like that shit was pretty wild, bro. Them niggas are sitting on train on fucking railways. I'm cool, bro. I'm cool, nigga. What? 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 Let's go. Part four. Let's go. Hi Carly. Crazy Steve was not just a sack. <laughs> crazy Steve was fucking crazy, fam. <laughs> that nigga was crazy. He also a murderer, killing Drake and Josh. Nigga, you can never kill Drake and Josh. What the fuck is he man? He also kidnapped Megan. Megan. Forcing her to be his hostage, thus trapping her in a sadistic relationship as fake siblings Carly and Spencer. Nathan Crest, Freddy. Uh, go fucking do one, bro. Fucking do one. Meaning and theories part five. SpongeBob. Squidward's father died, leading him to isolation and major clinical depression. Ooh, sorry, Squid. His self-isolation caused him to become severely antisocial and apathetic. Ooh. SpongeBob's parents decided to help by giving him their only son, his only friend. Skin, because you do that, yeah, as a parent. Happy to have a best friend, uh, but scarred by the grief and trauma of his father's death. He struggled with life and. What's wrong with this you fam? What's wrong with this fucking Corbin blue haired type fucking sadistic type young G blood? Why is he fucking why is he trying to kill why is he trying to kill Squidward blood? Like relax big man, yeah? Max and Ruby. Oh, I never watched this. Max and Ruby's parents were never seen because they're alcoholic. 
<laughs> alcoholic or rabbits. The residue she lost control when driving and hitting a car. Max was permanently brain damaged. Ooh. Max only plays with ambulance and cars because there's all he remembers from the crash. Alright, Max. That's why I can't speak in complete sentences because he's blurting out words out of the time. Okay, bro, bro. That's rude, that's rude. I take that back. Maybe so from PTSD. Ever since Max accident, she hides it by blah blah blah. Take your fucking palm out of my face, bitch. Phineas and Ferb. Fi Ferb was severely bullied and decided to end his pain by taking his own life. Oh, Ferb was on. Kind of unable to cope with a brother's death created an imaginary world where he exists. Ooh. Ferb was disabled and can hardly talk or do much. Ferb? Doofus Merch is a psychiatrist. Kind of sees him as a villain in her own world. Her mum doesn't see the amazing adventures because her brother because it's all in her. <gasps> Their mum never saw, you know. Yo, Candice is crazy. Look at her face, blood. Yo, she's tapped. No, nah, that's fucked up, but feeling some. Phineas is so affordable. Nah, that's some fuck shit. Nah, that is some fuck shit. That is some fuck shit. Fuck you, yeah, you fucking bushy head prick. Why you why you why why do you want to be doing this? Eh? You bastard face. Look at look at look at your face, idiot. With the, the, the horses behind you. You are the horse. You yourself are the horse. With your horse hair. I wanted to fuck up Phineas on fire me, man. I'm cool, blood. I'm cool. Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig was never healthy and always sick. Because you're a pig, duh. You eat trash. What the fuck? One night, Peppa's parents decided uh, it would be best if they euthanized her. That night, Peppa fell asleep and was injected with a poison, killing her. This caused her to want to be a fairy because her last dream was about fairies. Peppa's parents couldn't live with the guilt of what they did to their child. Ah! Ah! So you are euthanizing your kid and then you think you can go and survive and keep living this life? You are, you are, you are foolish. Can these stupid parents. That was fucked up. That was fucked up. Patrick Star story. Patrick suffered from Down syndrome. <laughs> Nigga, we knew. <laughs> Nigga, we knew that. His parents loved him, but couldn't handle the pain of raising him. Okay. Kicking him out as a child. Fucking great parenting. Alright. Patrick doesn't remember this. <laughs> Patrick was on. Look how cute he looks, man. I'd adopt that motherfucker. I'd definitely adopt that motherfucker. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Living homeless under a rock. <laughs> Shock. Patrick's parents told Spongebob to look after him. Aye. Becoming best friends. Aye. Timmy Turner's story. Timmy! Timmy Turner! Timmy's fairies are antidepressants. Cosmo is Zoloft and one, uh, one day Xanax. Whoa. Cosmo helping with depression, one with anxiety. Whoa. They only show up when Timmy has problems. Just like drugs, there are serious side effects of using their magic. All this time, Timmy has been tripping balls, man. <laughs> Timmy, give up them drugs, baby. Give up them drugs, nigga. Shit. That's the end of the video. I'm not gonna lie, some of that, some of that shit was bullshit, man, because it didn't get to me in the air, but I think it was really trying, man, but fuck it, man, man, solid in here. Anyways, guys, like, share, subscribe, yeah, click it, click the like button, especially, and it's all my team, click rank up, like that, like that. Let me know in the comments what you want me to react to next. Give me, listen, like, don't just give me music, innit? Give me some fucking wild shit, innit? Give me some, some out there shit, innit? Yeah? I'm trying to, trying to be different, baby. Peace, love to you, though, anyway.